the little recording button. So in the top left corner of your screen, you guys should see a red flashing dot that lets you know this is now being recorded. Um, while we have a couple of families here with us today and it's on the recording, just to let all of our families know the makeup of the virtual sessions for the next um, two, three weeks, whatever, three weeks, three weeks, Margaret. Uh, it's too early for math. <laughs> um, so the makeup for this next virtual period is going to be the same as our existing ones that we have already done together. So we will have a 10 a.m. session and an 1130 session Monday through Friday. Um, Tiger Zoom News with Clark and Amy is going to continue to be at 1030. And if there are any changes, we will be definitely letting you know. Both Connie and I have emailed out links for the upcoming virtual period. Everything is in one document in one place for this whole period. And we'll be making updates directly to that sheet that you guys will be able to see on your end without us sending any further updates. Although we'll still email you because that's what we do. <laughs> Did I forget anything, Connie? No, cool. All right, so today's lesson, we are going to resume our conversation surrounding time of day. So we often talk about AM or PM or morning or night. And so today we're going to talk about AM and PM. Okay. So AM and PM, it's kind of a weird conversation because AM means what? Ant Antimortium AM. Connie, what does that mean again? Ant After morning? I don't know. Maybe we should Google it because you know, I'll I'm not, Google it. I'm not having a smart morning today, guys. So AM, what does it mean? Before noon used with times of day between midnight and noon. It is anti, oh, it's anti-meridium. Oh, I said mortium. Mortium's death. That's not what we want. Ash, Ash I can't hear you. That's a you problem, Connie. I think everyone else can hear me. Yep, I can hear you fine. Okay, I would say I, I saw nodding. <laughs> So I think it's a, your computer maybe on silent or something. So AM means an, anti-mortium, meridium. <laughs> and PM means post, post-meridium, I believe, or pre-meridium, pre pre-meridium. So AM is the time of day before noon. It's activities that happen in the morning are typically like breakfast, getting dressed, we usually brush our teeth in the AM. Um, we usually go to our jobs or our school, or we do um, some type of like work school activity because we're virtual and it's AM right now. Um, so those are all things that happen before noon. PM is the time after noon and it is when we have lunch, we have dinner, we go to sleep, we put on our pajamas. It's usually a time for family in my, at least in my house. It's when we all have come home from work or school or we've gotten all of our tasks done for the day. If we're at home, like our chores, because I have weekend chores, I do. Um, and it's when we spend time with family. That's more like recreation and leisure and fun stuff. Is that how your days are made up? Yes or no? Okay, I see. Mr. AJ is a yes. He spends his days kind of like that too. Miss Margaret and Miss Kasha and Miss Denise all said yes. Their days are kind of like that. Joey says yes, very excitedly. Yes. Okay, Miss Carla said yes. Okay, so that's kind of how our days are made up. It's kind of like business in the AM, fun in the PM, party in the PM. Okay, so that's kind of how we operate our day. So we are going to, oh, I'm going to let someone in. So when we are going to look at these today, we're going to look at the picture and kind of see what they're doing. We're going to look at the picture and decide what they're doing. And then we're going to decide if it happens in the AM or PM. So for today's activity, we need our A and B cards. A is going to be AM and B is going to be for PM. Okay, or B for P. Okay. All right. So when we look at this picture, it's a little boy in a red shirt and he's got a box on his table, a bowl of white stuff.
stuff. He's got a cup with a jar of something that has an orange on it. So what do you guys think he could be doing? He's got a jar of something with an orange on it. Joey is very clearly telling me a, um, he is very clearly telling me a, um, okay. The teachers are agreeing with him. So when I look at this picture, I'm thinking that he's probably having breakfast. Do you guys agree? Is he having breakfast? Yes or no? Yes. Okay. Yep. He is. So he's having cereal in his bowl of milk with a glass of orange juice. So Joey very quickly showing me A for the win. Woohoo, buddy. You nailed it. It is AM activity. Although I kind of like Brinner. Is it Brinner? when it's like breakfast for dinner, Brenner. But we're gonna, we're gonna assume it's AM because we usually have breakfast in the morning. All right, we're gonna move on to our little friend right here in the blue shirt. They've got, looks like a jar of something. And then they're got a washcloth on their face with some bubbles. So maybe they're cleaning their face. So when do you guys clean your face? Miss Denise says AM and PM. Miss Kasha says AM and PM. Miss Margaret says AM and PM. AJ is shooting an AM. Miss Carla is shooting a PM. Joey has AM and PM. Miss Connie has AM and PM. All right. So I'm an AM face washer, but you guys are all right. We usually wash our faces all throughout the day, depending on what we do and the type of skin that we have. And usually the type of activity you do. So if you do like a lot of working out or a lot of exercise, you probably should do it more than one time a day. I have really dry skin and it makes my face hurt. So I only do it one time a day. All right, next one. We have a bus. We have a little girl with a backpack on. So maybe she's getting on the bus. Joey is saying A very quickly again. He's saying A. <laughs> AJ's confirming A with his friend Joey. Miss Kasha's saying A and B. And I get why she's saying it. She's quite clever, our Miss Kasha. Okay. So A is the choice that most of our friends are saying, and they're getting on the bus to go to school, is assume is what I'm assuming is happening in the picture. I think Miss Kasha is saying A and B because we get on the bus to go to school and we get on the bus to go home. So Miss Kasha says both, but I think what we were, most of us were thinking is you're getting on the bus to go to school, which was A for AM. So good job guys, you did excellent. We're gonna check out this one right here. We have a little boy, he's got quite big feet. Um, he's putting on a shirt in this picture. He's putting on his little red shirt. So what do you guys think? Is he putting on his shirt in the AM. Do you put your shirt on in the AM or in the PM? Miss Lori, if you don't have AB cards, which you probably don't because you're just joining us for the first time, um, you can sign it too. If you, so A or B for sign. Okay, so we have mixed answers. I see lots of A's. AJ is saying A and B and Joey is saying A. So I think what this picture is probably asking us is getting dressed in the morning, which would be A, but sometimes you get hot during the day or you get cold during the day and you need to change your outfit. And I know the friends in my room see their teachers constantly putting jackets on and then taking them off, putting them back on and then taking them off because our furnace runs on and off throughout the day and then we get to cook in. So it could be both, but getting dressed, usually we get dressed in the morning. So AM would be our answer. I think you guys are all like scarred from me tricking you last week or the week before. Now you're always giving me all the answer options. <laughs> I guess it's my fault for tricking you guys. All right. So we have a picture of a window with a sun behind the hills. And it's looking pretty yellow and orange in the sky. So I'm guessing that this means the sun going up because I think if it was the sun going down, we would see some blue and black in the sky. So I'm guessing it's sun going up. Let's see, what do our friends think? 
Our teachers are in locked in with their answers. Let's see. Joey and AJ, do you confirm? Joey says B, that it would be PM. Mr. AJ, what are you thinking? All right, let's, we'll see if AJ pops his answer up, but we're gonna go. Joey keeps saying B. So if the sun is going up, that probably means it's AM where we live, okay? So if the sun is going up, the sky is getting brighter, which is what we're thinking from the orange sky. The sun is going up, it's AM. Our sun goes up in the morning, usually when we're on our way to school or work or, you know, I run errands in the morning just so I usually get them done because I don't like to like wait around and do them. All right, our next picture, we have a little boy and he's putting his blanket on his bed. So he's probably making his bed. So do you make your bed in the morning or at nighttime? So AM or PM? Joey's very clearly saying AM, he makes his bed in the AM. I see lots of teachers saying AM and I'm gonna be a bad role model and I'm just gonna hold up a no because I don't make my bed unless I just put new sheets on it. I'm with you, Ashley, I don't either. Well, Miss Ashley, to be truthful, I don't make my bed, but Mr. Lewis makes my bed. Oh. So it does get made, but that's his, that's his chore. Yeah, I, I don't. Um, I only make it when either people are coming over and I want my room to look really clean or I just put sheet, new sheets on my bed, so. I'm the opposite of you, Mrs. Lewis. My husband usually is the one late getting out of bed later. He doesn't make it. So I, if I'm working in person, I make it when I get home. <laughs> yeah. So, so sometimes our chores or when we do things is dependent on our schedule. So that's what we just hear. Now, most people make their bed in the AM when they get out of it. So like when they're getting ready in the morning, they just make their bed. And that seems to be what most people do. But sometimes they don't make it till the PM. And that's okay too. And then you have some friends that just don't make it at all. <laughs> and that's okay too. I change my sheets at night. So usually that would be a um, PM for me if I were going to count that. All right. We have our next picture. It's a little girl brushing her hair. When do we brush our hair? In the PM or in the AM? When do you brush your hair? Joey said AM. I saw that, Joey. I saw it. Hey. I don't like your sad face. I want to see happy Joey. Yeah, there we go. AM. So AJ confirms it's AM. We've got a couple of teachers that are saying A and B, so they must brush their hair throughout the day. Yeah. But for the most part, we brush our hair in the morning to get ready for the day. We maybe for the ladies, we put it up in a bun or a ponytail or make sure it's down and looking nice. Our gentleman friends have very nice, easy hair, quick brush, and they're good to go. So that makes sense. All right. So we have a little boy who's doing the calendar. So when do we do the calendar? Is it PM or AM? When do we do calendar? AJ says AM. Joey, do you agree with AJ? He does. He does. All right. Good job, guys. It is AM. We do it in our classrooms in the morning. Um, our classroom usually does it about 930 in the morning. Miss Connie, what time do you guys usually do it? I don't think Miss Connie can hear you, but yeah, we do ours in the morning as well in Miss Connie's room. We usually do it around 11 o'clock. Yeah, so still in the morning, 11 a.m. So just yep. because we do it at different times, it's all still a.m. It's in the morning before lunch. All right, you guys. We have a couple more. We have eight more. So maybe we'll, we'll quit early because you guys are rocking these smart little cookies. All right, so we have a little girl and she's got a bag in her hand and it looks like maybe there's some potato chips in it. 
when would we eat some potato chips? AM or PM? Yeah, I'm with Miss Lori. <laughs> I'm with Miss Lori. <laughs> the correct answer is probably PM, you know, but sometimes it happens in the AM. <laughs> It does, let's be honest. But you, the correct answer is we usually have snacks in the afternoon, so the PM. All right, our next little picture, we have a little girl sleeping in her bed. So when you guys go to bed and fall asleep, is that in the AM or the PM? Joey's rocking a B very clearly. I saw that, Joe. AJ confirms B for PM. Nice work, friends. All right. We have a little boy. He's putting on his bluish purple pajamas. So he's putting on his pajamas. Does that happen in the morning, the a.m. or in the p.m.? Teachers are locking in with B. Joey is saying B and AJ confirms. Good job, you guys. So it would be p.m. We put on our pajamas. Okay, so when does it happen that she's got what looks like a sandwich in her hands and a glass of juice maybe? So probably eating lunch. Sandwich seems kind of like a lunch food to me. So is that in the PM or the AM? Joey's giving me a B. The teachers are saying B. AJ confirms B. So yeah, we have lunch kind of in the PM typically. In our classroom, we eat lunch at noon. So that starts right there, PM. So we eat our lunch in the PM. Miss Connie's room has been eating lunch at about 12, 15, 12, 20 ish. Well, so they're eating 12, 32. Okay. So they're eating in the PM too. So for the most part, we eat lunch in the PM. All right, let's get our last four done and then we'll call it uh, I broke it. <laughs> oh, phew, unbroke. Okay. <laughs> Technology today. Okay. So we're just going to do our last four super quick, and then we will be done with this activity for today, for this morning, and we'll see you guys at 1030. But let's get our last four done really quick if it'll go to it. Sorry for the technology issues, friends. All right, our last four. We have a little boy who looks like he's getting off the bus. So he's getting off the bus. Joey says B, you get off the bus to go home. Miss Kasha's saying A too, because I you get off the bus when you get to school, but we're gonna assume this is getting off the bus to go home. AJ's confirming a B, I believe. I think I saw a B boop. All right, so B, you get off the bus in the PM at home. Yep, AJ confirmed with a B boop. Okay. Next, we have somebody reading in bed. They've got a light on. So with a light on, it probably means it's pretty dark. So we've got a light on and they're reading in bed. So does that happen in the AM or the PM? Joey's got a B, showing me B. Teachers are showing me B. That's right. So AJ confirmed the B, okay. So yeah, that happens in the PM. Usually some people read in bed before they fall asleep. That's what I do. Although sometimes if I wake up really early, I read in bed and it's dark out too, but you know, mostly in the PM. All right. We have somebody hanging up their coat and backpack, but I want you guys to look, there's no lockers. So my guess is this is at somebody's home. So you would do that. Joey saying P PM. Joey's saying PM. Teachers, teachers are saying PM and AJ confirms it is PM. Yeah, you hang your backpack up when you get home from school. And our last one, it looks like somebody might be doing homework or an art project and they've got a book and some, looks like lots of colored pencils. Joey's saying B, PM, which makes sense, yeah. Teachers are saying A and B, Miss Lori is saying B, Miss Denise is saying B. AJ saying B. 
So typically in our rooms, we kind of do a lot of our fun activities in the afternoon, which would be PM. You might be doing those projects at home with mom and dad or a friend or a brother and a sister. And those all usually happen in the PM. That's right. Sometimes we do do those activities in the morning, but PM is a pretty good answer. So way to go, guys. You rocked AM versus PM this morning. So we will see you at 1030 for Zoom news with Miss Amy and Mr. I almost called him Miss Clark. That would have got me in trouble. Mr. Clark. He watches these recordings. Mr. Clark. Mr. Um, and then at 1130, we are doing a boom card activity to practice our skills on where does it go? So I hope to see you guys there. Thanks for joining us this morning. Bye, friends. Bye, Joey. Bye, AJ. Okay. Bye. Bye, Joey. Bye, AJ.